Robot C's new controller configuration utility allows you to use custom joystick controllers to manage your robot's movements. Let's take a look at how we can use this new feature to set up an Xbox 360 controller. Let's plug the new controller into the computer and test drive a robot using one of the remote control sample programs in virtual worlds. You may notice that the robot is hard to control with your new joystick. Fortunately, the controller configuration utility will be able to fix that. You can find this new feature under the window menu when in expert or super user mode. Clicking on the configure joystick option will open the controller configuration utilities window. If your joystick doesn't appear in the current controller box, you may need to press the refresh button until it does. Now you can use the robot C name, hardware mapping, and current value displays to configure your own specific joystick setup. For the Xbox controller, the Joy-1 X2 is set to the left Z axis, which is the left rear trigger. This default setting is what causes the control issues. Changing this mapping to a physical joystick will make controlling the robot much easier. Run the sample program again using the new custom joystick settings. Much better! Now we don't have to worry about the robot running in circles. If the robot still isn't responding to the joystick commands correctly, you may need to double check the controller configuration utility settings again until a desirable mapping is reached.